Oh, yeah, yeah, most definitely, most definitely. It's the bad, bad, see, last Yeah, yeah, you know, we go get it to Barack, you know, Obama, you know, he on stage last night rapping, you know, Eminem classic, historical, inspirational, motivational song, Lose Yourself. On the sweaty, mm -mm, on the sweaty, he's vomiting on the sweat already. My Oscar got it. You know, it's historical, you know, you know somebody got a statue in the inspirational influence of Obama. You know, when, you know, Eminem lyrics, you know, I know he's the biggest rapper in the world, but still, you know, Barack on a different type of timing, you know, he listen to different type of music, probably, you know. So I mean, you know, hip hop culture, you know, at that time where people say music is done, hip hop is done, you know, I beg the differ, you know, I beg the differ, you know, that's an inspirational song, even though I became a big YouTuber, you know, I still got hope in the music, you know, I still got hope in hip hop, you know, and Eminem coming out, co-signing Kamala Harris and, you know, Obama, even though, you know, Obama ain't running it, you know, I'm gonna make a separate video about, you know, Eminem, Cosign, and, you know, Kamala Harris, but, you know, it's C. Lansky. I'm back in full effect. 2424. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Most definitely. Most definitely. It's the bad man, C. Lansky. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, Tyler the Creator, he got his new album coming out next Monday, October 28th, and things of that nature. You know, I got the internet and the friends, he got the world in the uproar, you know. They saying if, you know, he gonna be the next one to come save hip hop and music overall. We gotta wait to see. But he just announced that he going on tour with Paris, Texas. I don't know who that is. I ain't gonna hold you. I gotta tap in and Lobo, Lil Yachty, you know. He said Lil Yachty coming on the tour with him as well. You know, he just dropped like a couple songs, you know what I'm talking about. Yachty dropped like four or five songs. So maybe he got an album on the way, but you know, Tyler the Creator dropped like two new videos. He just um dropped a bit like yesterday with the vinyl version of his album that's still on the way. So you know, he coming with some different type of sonical type of joint, you know. Every time he come out with an album, you know, people going to uproar, you know. I've been listening to that since like 2010, 2011, you know. So let's see what the album sound like. Most definitely, you know, it's C. Lansky, yeah, yeah. Uh huh, yeah, yeah, most definitely, most definitely, it's the bad man, see, Lansky. Yeah, yeah, so we're gonna get into this, you know, Kendrick Lamar scissor interview. Yeah, yeah, so, you know, I guess they politicking, you know, because they locked in, you know, they had classics and a lot of moments together, you know, even though, you know, Kendrick Laffin started PG Lane, you know, he's still tied in that TDE. So of all people, you know, he got scissor, you know, to do the interview, he could have got a desk. Uh, he could have got, you know, Sway, he could have got anybody, but you know, you had to pick the home team, right? Because, you know, Sway so just had that song with that boy, Jay-Z Drake, and Sexy Red right at the top of the year, you know? So, you know, Kendrick will orchestrate whatever move he do. So, even though summer over, and, you know, we even halfway through fall almost, you know, winter soon come, you know, he's trying to keep that not like us, momentum running for the Super Bowl and the Grammys at the top of 25, 25, 2025. So, you know, she asked him a couple of questions, you know. He just gonna get straight to the point, you know. He basically trying to downplay, you know, not like us, you know. I said, it's just one of them regular songs, you know. He basically saying, y'all, it was called for, but, you know, he really back to call Mr. Morale Timer, you know. I think he joking, you know. I think he joking around, you know. You know I, I think it was around the time of Drake, you know, birthday. This is just a casual conversation with two people that knew each other for like a decade. So how is this even an interview? You know, they just conversating, you know, just keeping the things, you know, keeping it calm, you know, at the end of the day. Like I said, Kendrick could have really had a real interview, even with a big boy in the morning or somebody. They know each other. They both locked in, you know, like I said, he's just trying to keep that momentum going, you know. Because the Grammys and the Super Bowl, all that joint, right around the way, you know, right around the corner. So, let's just see what moves they pull next. Is Drake going to drop that party next door album? Is he going to close to fall with a classic year and come back with a vengeance like he did when it was the Pussy Seat battle with a meat pill battle? Or everything calm. I guess we got to wait to see. Let's see, Lansky. Yeah, yeah.
Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Most definitely. Most definitely. Just the bad man, see and Nancy. You know, we gonna get into a new topic. You know, with Drake's next move. Yeah, yeah. You know, I think Drake birthday tomorrow or something like that. You know, I ain't academics. You know, he know facts for sure. You know, you know. So I can actually a life, but I'm keeping it a hundred. I don't know if gang birthday was yesterday, today, or tomorrow. But sometimes these times, you know, October's very on. You know, I think you know he said he dropping an album or party next door. Or some things of that nature. So we're going to see what that's like, you know. Keep it a hundred off. He dropped that right now. I don't even know if the game going to really rock with it. See how they did that house album he dropped. Never mind or something like that. They told him never mind. I was the original. Um, Keep that, delete that before Cole dropped that. So, you know, it could be calm, probably, you know, R&B joints. You know, the ladies going to rock with it. The shorties going to fight with it. But right now, we need that started from the bottom joint for the streets. You know, the price is on, you know. The price is on. Price to make diamonds, you know. Speaking of that, you know, my hour will rock nation out now. You know, cop that. You know, I'm just a retired musician turned YouTuber. But, you know, it's a lot of pressure right now. You know, Apple Music got Drake as, you know, the face of hip-hop on the website and things of that nature. So that let me know something is in the works, you know. Something is on the way, so we just gotta wait to see. You know, Friday will he drop, or it'll be a single album collab. He gotta do something quick, cause Kendrick going that back. He ain't lighting up. My advice: he gotta get some people back on his side quick, cause once the Grammys happen, and you know the Super Bowl, if he performed that now like us at both of them events, you know his career is. Oh no, it might be quiet. You know, I, I know you are liking. But everybody got to have their time, you know, to fall back. Like Fat Joe said in the New York song, even Roy Jones was forced to lay back. So, gang, if you don't come back with something before then, I don't know. We seen, you know, Ja Rule, who was on the top of the game, even he had to fall back. So, ain't nobody invincible. I mean, some people are invincible. But, I don't know, gang. <sighs> Better come back quick. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Most definitely, most definitely. It's the Batman Silansky. Yeah, yeah. So I'm back with a question, you know. The musicians drop their music exclusively on the gram. You know, on Instagram, so we start dropping our tunes, you know, exclusively on Instagram and then later put it on DSPs. Because, you know, the big three done did it. In my eyes, a lot of people don't give him the credit, but Drake, you know, he dropped that very, the live response to Kenny right before Kenny dropped. Not like us, you know, meet the Grams. You know, he dropped that exclusively on the Gram. That was really Drake doing that first. Cause Drake couldn't get that Tupac and Snoop AI voice clear to put that on all platforms. So he started dropping stuff exclusively on the Gram, you know, and then Kendrick followed up, you know. He dropped that, you know, watch the party die joint. You know, that's the last one he dropped. That was exclusively for the Gram, you know. And then, you know, Cole followed up with that Port Antonio. So, shut up the musicians that's on the rise, like me, even though I'm a seasoned legend, you know, but I'm retired. So, we just drop our tunes on Instagram and, you know, for, for the free, even put it on the tube, you know, and let it build up and then put it on all platforms. But I only work exclusively for the big dogs, you know, in the mainstream, you know. You know, we gotta wait to see, you know, it's just a clutch thing, you know, from C. Lansky. But, you know, another video on the way after this one. So stay tuned. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Most definitely, most definitely. It's the Batman C. Lansky. Yeah, yeah. So we're going to get into that glorious. I mean, ain't talking about notorious. Or people notorious big though, you know. But we talking about the glorious, you know. Oh, my. You know, Glorella. Most definitely, most definitely. Yeah, yeah. So we're just so more to... Lotto, you know, even though she had broke and a big mama, big mama, and all them heads, you know. And, and you know, even Ice Spice, who been scorching hot for the last two years, you know. You know, kind of like, you know, it been kind of like Glorella been kind of playing in the background role, you know. Treading behind, you know, Sexy Rat right there, but, you know, Sexy Rat been, you know, calling him and all that attention, you know, getting a trade feature. Nikki feature all that in the span of a few months, less than a year, her being in a line like so, you know, it breaking those, breaking those, you know, they said, you know, Glorella sold like seventy K, you know, more than all of her, you know, competition. So she basically the new queen of hip hop, you know. 
ami a kortig áll neki, a lázs, you know, a hell, a kari bírt, a táberek, fúcsány, vagy, you know, a sparta, no girls coming out, you know, see the hottest in a game. That's right, we're in the chain, that's right. See, Lansky, though. Yeah, yeah. And now what if I give a rap? You ever seen someone who has so much drive on a pivot crash? Ain't no more free cloud of going tip for tax. Years in, so let's see who click the last. Heart cold and stuff up in a blizzard trap. My cup still open fronted when I lift the glass.